What's going on, everybody? My name is Austin. You are back at Burkfire Game. We're here once again with 60 parsecs. I'm just gonna continue a new adventure. You know, that's how big Broncos. So this time we're gonna be uh, Megan Man. Well, hi, MJ. Oh, don't step on my, don't step on my headphones. Hey, Kiki. How you doing, buddy? Alright, man. I'll grab her first. Hey. Hey. You stop and trying to, trying to record. Okay. play. What do you? Can I help you? I'm trying to do a I'm trying to do a video here, Mister. Mister MJ, what? I think. How you doing? How you doing, buddy? Oops. Hi, kid. Dad loves you, but I gotta record. Go play. I know your sister's outside because she pees everywhere. Yeah, that's what happened. Some dog pees everywhere because she's still a pup. So I'll put her outside. Yes, I know you miss your sister. I'll bring her in a little bit. Go play. Alright, so I've already read all this. I don't, I don't care. Alright, um, I'll give a joy speech. Boom. Okay. Therefore, I'm going to give us a speech so determined to the point. Not any space captain, at least. You spoke of making your own luck and surviving. It really sounded like you knew what you're talking about, but did you? Okay. So they like my speech. This seems pretty important. Okay, um, we'll do this fly jacket. You're smart. And clam. Wham, bam. Thank you, damn. Oh, out of focus. Okay, we're good. Try that. See how that works out. Yeah, fuck. Bring your crew and plug the emergency console into the hard drive and delete the virus. So you thought, Captain, that was a power outlet. We were starting damage to the system. It took me six hours um, to fix the issue. Try it though. Can't grab anything else. 
damn it. Damn. Alright. So continue on. Um. Yeah. We'll save the soup. Um. Hell yeah. Go okay, Kankraft. Um. Yeah. Boom. This is going uh, considerably well, but it's only been a week, so, um, nice. Um, everybody's starving, so... Mm. That'll happen that way. Um... These are... Our brains, even though our brains kind of fucked us last time. I want to upgrade the lighter. Get a torch going. This blowtorch is bit down to the ground, boy. Uh, so what's going on here? The improvinator. Almost there. Uh, good job getting locker open, Captain. Took you about to figure out how to lockpick the thing, but your one in a million brain helped, or your one in a million lockpick, or both. So we got the locker open with some extra rations. Got a fan oh, I did get a fucking blowtorch! Hell yeah! <laughs> this time I'll we'll upgrade the suit. Seems important. Uh, you will decipher this. No, Tom will decipher the signals. Boom! Excuse me. Excuse me again. All right, so oh, we use a gas mask. Can't upgrade anything. The only thing I can do is recycle. I don't want to recycle anything. So we'll end the day there. I cannot tell me if you actually read the fixed reactor after this and leaflet, or if you just made random motions trying anything through the mask, but the leak is no more. Hey. Nice. I can upgrade again. Cast mask. Um. We'll have April do it. Apparently she's good with that kind of thing. This works out. Day 11. Uh, April's starving, Tom's starving, Emmett is starving, so... Bam! Bitch! Hey, that's a new planet I see in the background there. Uh, you and your crewmates untangled the wiring behind one of the panels. You found four pills of astrocytes and multivitamins along with wiring space, or at least it looked like full multivitamins. I still think it was mice droppings. Either way, you all feel revitalized after eating them. Oh, please let be vitamins. <laughs> um, okay, so we're hungry, but that's nothing. We're approaching some sort of celestial body. It resembles a moon, but I think it's a small planet. Uh, I was right, a small organic planet, but no organic life forms. A lot of movement down there. Um, okay, let's use the manual. Do anything else? I can craft something. Bam! Bitch! Smash! That's no moon! Oh no! That's not a moon. Oh, what is that? That is pretty fucking dope.
<laughs> Develop your trusty handbook looking for some kind of manual or at least how to land a spaceship for dummies chapter. Emmett knows the difference between bringing the book and helps you find the right chapter just in time. I uh, replug the crucial plug and steer towards the shuttle to the ground. Not a soft landing. Nobody's doing great um, after that stunt. Whatever is okay. So I can fix that. Can't do anything there. Uh, yeah, we'll fix it. That's why I built that. I was hoping I could before time ran out. Isn't it? Hello, world! Um, alright. Yeah, I'll read a book. Tourist information. L. Some motherfucking yeah, yeah. Tom will go. I'll send him with um, thing of soup and the, the suit. Still can't do anything. That's all right though. Blammy. Wham bam. Thank you, mammy. All right. Um. Okay. So we're all starting. So uh, soup for all. And we're probably gonna die. Yeah. Blue. Um, turns out a message from another group of survivors lost in space meaning for help. Unfortunately, it's impossible to pinpoint the exact location for fellow castaways. However, the knowledge that we are not alone is that enough to make you feel, you feel much better. Um, cool. Bam! Bam, bam, thank you, bam. Still can't craft biz niche. I got nothing. I got nothing. I ain't got Jack Diddley's squat doodle. Ah, shit balls, piss dicks. I don't have anything. I don't have shit. Hey, must be the money. Um, you fold your arms. <laughs> this ass is strong with this one. <laughs> She's just like. What are you gonna do? Kill me? What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. We can't do shit, boy. <laughs> when you sat down in front of the communication console, it was about to explode, you just folded your arm. The process froze for a second. That was highly logical. So was Adam leaving. Yeah, we're still here. How did you know it was not gonna blow up, Captain? I didn't. Okay. Um. <sighs> Excuse me. Approaches and today invited you to tinker together. She didn't make it sound like a big deal, but when I remember, she never invites anyone to work on her side with her. There's one more thing, Captain. Take the morality. April's blushing furiously. Seriously, she looks like a lobster. That could be some kind of space paper. Take extra care. It's might be getting a beautiful relationship. Hell yeah. I'll tinker with her. If you know what I mean. Duct tape.
Alright, I mean, you're leaving tomorrow. Have a good time! I expect you back in a few days. Um, you don't hesitate for a minute. You joined April. Together you tinkered. You even laughed. And once you touched your hands, you both reached for the same tool. It was very constructive. This may have been your first shared project, but it looks like it will not be the last. Alright. Oh yeah, it's gonna bug hunt. We could probably eat him. Soup! Oh my god, I need soup. I need soup so bad. I need soup real bad. Hey. I don't starve. I can't craft anymore, but damn it, I got him fed. I have a bug, Captain. I don't know who modified my code, but sick, the consequences could be devastating. You need to open my back panel and perform a emergency fix. Uh, I, I will do the surgery with, with brains. Bark. Okay, so I fixed it. Um, the agility. Bam, bitch. I scared him off by running. There's a robot here. That got hurt. Damn, I don't have any food, so you're all just gonna die of starvation. Hey, he's back. Um, I got some fucking food. I can create more food, I think. Nope, I can create another one of those, which I don't need. Spotted, someone spotted an astrocyst in emergency car crate. I had to check. My odds are infinite, infinitesimally small. Um, oh my gosh. I also need to mm -hmm. eat. Mm -hmm. And you need to eat. What's the robot statue? Wait. I don't find a gun in the museum, that's pretty dope. I'll go here. She'll take gas mask and tape. No. Gas mask and the vest. Oh, what did I do to that fucking artifact? I don't know, man. That's kind of terrifying. It really is. That artifact is fucking terrifying. Alright, how are you feeling today, Captain? Much better, apparently, after you injected yourself with that syringe. Yes, the... Intravenous relay paid off. It must uh, contain slarp. Standard issue liquid for precision rejuvenation. Um, your base metal 
physical abilities were improved for the time being at least. I'm very sure you keep staring out the window in the endless void. Why? Did you lose something? I see you remembering Earth. I admit it was nice before the nuclear barbecue, that is. No, it's fine. I'm just depressed. I'll be okay. That's right, Captain. Keep your emotions in check and develop unhealthy coping mechanisms. That should be that should keep you standing. Hell yeah. Uh, you're still quite alert. Your tummy, stomach feels rather right, or empty. Cutting edge sock. Oh, it is a cutting edge sock. Sorry, I mean, you're just gonna die. Um, right up alien herbs. Uh, uh, light it on fire, I guess. What would that do for me? Meet the Petersons. What? So I lit the heavens up, leaves up to freshen the air inside the shuttle. Everyone sat on the floor for hours enjoying the sweet smelling smoke. Made your mind so clear. My so high. <laughs> I was high. Sure, we'll speak. I don't have anything for you, I mean, you're just gonna mm -hmm. die. That's how it's gonna happen. I'm sorry. I just came back. Nice. Can I craft soup? I can craft soup. Uh, you are starving. Okay, <laughs> so you get soup. And lucky for you, you survived long enough to get your own soup. Um, tape it. Fix everything with tape. Nope, hold on. Shut up! Alright, we're good. Uh, you wouldn't remove tape until you could not steal energy from the ship. Um, no idea, it was James Prokoff from the borrow your electricity. Um, okay. This is all very strange. I need to see. I'm attempting a huge energy surge beneath the surface, sizing waves. I think there's an earthquake coming. The shuttle, the shuttle is sturdy, but this ground isn't. Um, yeah, why not? I'm pretty, pretty good at what I do. Problem soup. Bing pot. Bumped to and fro like a bat on a fair entry, but the shaking stopped, you opened your eyes, and strange silence followed. Then you laughed. 
So I guess I'm okay. No. I don't do that where you break something. Right, we lasted a month, which is good. We're doing good. Oh, God. Hey there, Captain Buzzkill. Feeling better? Fuck you. Fuck. Can't make no more soup. Can't upgrade nothing. Okay. Turn myself. And I come back, you can blame it all on me. I'm your captain, and I need food tonight. <sighs> okay, so the extraterrestrial contamination was no match for the extraterrestrial issue environmental mask. A quarantine and protocol will be executed at your earliest convenience, Captain. Did a CPU breaking to report that the air filter in the mask is now spent, rendering it unusable. Um, you've been fiddling with loose cable all morning. Can we remove where does it go? What does it even do? Okay. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. Bam, bitch! Alright, so... Hey! And they came back and he brought a lot of soup. I'll build one of these first, because that's pretty important. Okay, Tom, take a look at that. <laughs> Bam! Bitch! Heck. It was sticking around. I don't know where he went. I don't know. Yeah, Tom fought around with the communicator. Tom spent hours, several hours with it, taking it apart, putting it back together. When he was finished, the communicator looked, functioned, looked and functioned slightly better. Okay. You're not starving. You're just weak. Okay, you're fine. Then. This is still building. Tape. Tom will go. He'll go with the the the, the handbook and the lighter. You are starting. Mm. Bitch. Um. He's still very weak. Okay, a sweet old looking man. Sweet old man looking like Charles Darwin is now can your air lock playfully. You let him in, he shakes your hand, holds you with an iron grip, and won't let go. With technology evolution stops. Soviet scientists want our species to stay strong, so they've created me, the natural selection bot. Because for your own good, which is what the dentist says, you didn't believe him either. You let me in, despite the warning signs. Now you face predator. Uh, you face now face your space predator, human. It is a point, Captain. Oh, I can see why you postpone discussion. Defend yourself. I will defend myself. The Darwinian predator droid held you with his grip. You thrust yourself back, and with one swift, mo mo swift motion, slipped the armor on. It put a gun, pulled a gun, and shot. But your armor held. You braced yourself. Off. No, I didn't. Um, but the droid did was far worse than anything you could have imagined. 
I was so afraid I'd have to kill you, it said, but it shared a sentiment. But you were excellent defending yourself, thus worthy to survive. I'm so glad. I was reading that. I hugged you tightly like a very friendly boa and left. Oh gosh. I'm starving. He's weak. So, you need soup. He needs the med kit. I need to craft some soup. Um, maybe by the communicator? Or no, by the, the tape? Boom! Bitch! Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah, I've already seen all of this. We found some stuff. Perfect. Now I have a lighter. We already had a lighter, but okay. Um, all those bleeps and bloops from the navigation computer are annoying to some, but one person is drawing my digital tune. It's April. She's tapping her foot to the rhythm. Admit it, Captain. You're into it too. My medical database confirms dance is widely accepted form of exercise and helps combat muscle atrophy on a long space journey. Come on, Astro Citizens. It's for your own good. Dance a little. Radar bleeping out to your liking. Captain, I can play some, something else for you to dance. Somebody, what you in the mood for, and I will find something appropriate. Now dance. Dance, I said! Okay. 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 I'll dance. I'll do the strength dances. Oh, 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 oh. Anyway, I'm dumb. We'll go to the museum. We'll send April. We'll go with armor and soup. Yeah. All right. So that should be good. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh. oh, oh. Um, you dance with April like there's no tomorrow. She's out of breath and I'm not be thrilled. It's like Space Mardi Gras party. She cried joyfully while bursting. While busting a move that would make old timers faint. Sheets working. Um, you did all you could to fix robotic animal in both your tool selection and technological know how we're limited. If you're set up amending a sad pile of crap vaguely reminiscent of a dog, you have to grab some actual parts from around the planet. Okay. Um, there's a robot city passing outside. Yes, Starlight City is mobile. Floats uh, above the planet Solar Terminator, the Twilight Line, where it becomes, where day becomes night. The city has both a day and night side, but it's 100% Starlight powered. Um, okay, who's fast? Go. Oh, you're probably better at this than anybody else. I think. Wait. Wait, it looks starving. Cool. Bam! I think I kind of finally caught up with this food shortage. Uh, the floating robot said he slowed down, let you catch up to the robots, gave you oxygen instead, insisted on giving you free stuff. Oh, they're so nice. Um, so they give you a first aid kit. Oh, okay, I was crafting one, but you know, that works. Soup me up, boy. Okay, you are hungry. You are pretty hungry. Um, Captain Man, a pair of robots are meandering towards us. They are facing each other and appear to be fused at the hands. One is a large hole dragging the other with a smaller in stature. Um, my little one pulls her soon from his back. Okay.
I'll feed the little one. I don't know what to do about that. I don't have a charging port, so I can't really charge with the big one. You carried super with a parent and robot child parent was slowly charging past the shovel. You pried open tin and poured open a little delicious stuff into the robo. The fumes spewing out of his off board promptly stopped. Um, as a parent droid who questioned the mechanical offering close in a rich display of love, you and your crew watched with pride, swelling your chest as they walked off in the distance. Nice. I'm starving now. <laughs> I don't have anything to protect myself, so I could be fucked. I need a gun, 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 gun. Decided to stay inside, like I recommended. Very wise. You and your crew spent the evening watching the meter shower through the windows. There were a lot of wishes made, and ohs and ahs, utter and ah. Really, Ash citizens? They're just rocks. No need to get weird about it. Oh, my book died. Um, okay. Okay. Bam, bitch. You and the other crewmates dug up the fancy coffee maker and discovered it was still full of beans genetically engineered to meet robot taste, meaning the longest and lasting best tasting in the universe. They're still good. Um, okay. Can have a lot of minerals. And a gun! I have a gun! I got a gun! Upgrade the gun. I want to see what that does. I'm with tape. I don't know what it is, but I need tape. You are weak. Going to the robot grave yard. Grave yard. Hardo. Um. There is the gun. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Um. This is Captain Say. It's meant for you. You have the code? No, does not compute. Were you really committed, uh, appointed captain by Astro Citizen Command? Uh, for now, since you don't have the code, you'll have to try to open this face by source or dexterity. I'll go with dexterity. Bam! Bitch! Okay. What the hell? Man, scrap the code. I knew you were nimble fingered enough to get that done. Um, the only thing is I was a piece of paper thread to do. Put something useful in the safe. Thanks for nothing. Yeah. Thanks for not a bitch. Alright, I'll, I'll look at that. This is a rash. Yay. He's starving. <laughs> I am starving. Oh. She is starving. That's, that's his soulmate. It is a soulmate. Bam! Um, okay. Oh. oh, fuck, I'm tired. I don't have anything.
It looks fixed, but I don't have a battery, so... Sorry. Tommy should be back soon. That'll be nice to have Tommy Boy back. Oh, speak of the fucking devil. Um, he found a shovel. The day gets done. Perfect. Craft me a set of soups. Um. No. Wait. Yeah, no. Fuck that shit. Machines entering the cabin was becoming a torrent when he gave the command to stop them, so I ran a current through the hole. Uh, oh, hello, small ionizing micrometer machinery in the morning. I call that technique bot die. Where it came from? What they had wished to do with the crew if only the machines would solution to all life mysteries. Okay, so I got soup. Which Tom immediately needs. Bam! Biz niche boy. Right. Okay. Yeah, let's see. Um. Captain, we're receiving a universal message from another AI. Greetings, meat cloak clocks. We are the legion of disorganized robots. We keep no activity logs and never change our oil. Our, our wires grow long and beautiful. We are the chaos of the universe. Meat embodies order. Therefore, you all must be destroyed. We are the legion. We are disorganized. Hail chaos. Okay. Strength. Fuck them battles. Here's a shovel. I'm very curious how that would work. And Provenator. Okay, we scared him off. Um, <sighs> nice. Got a better shovel. Where is it at? Uh, oh wow, looks like a fucking jackhammer. Bitch. Beatrice. Alright. Starving. Starving. Um. Nothing. Oh, got nothing. Come on, Emmett. Come on back. Come on back. Hey! Let me find a lighter. Brought home some soup. Important for the dog. He's starving, it's fine. He's starving. Uh, 
Um, let me just strength instead. Forward everything, I think. Um, oh, eight out of twelve. I can't click and drag or anything. I guess I'll go back to the assembly line. Or maybe not. Yeah, we'll go there. I need a new handbook anyway, and this is a chance for science. So we'll send Tom out. Take a can of soup with him. And. The body on him. Oh, then. Um. <laughs> Everyone wanted to type up reply. The crew kept shoving each other away from the keyboard until someone accidentally pressed send with their elbow. Your transmission consists of complete gibberish. Maybe you can convince them that we're cast. Reply came shortly after just saying, Congratulations, no robots detected. Intellect level too low. Okay. Got it. Nice. Okay. Soup. Super, 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 super. I brought to some design beautiful machines. Never mind your why. Uh, never mind why. Now pay attention. I found a food dispensing machine on board. Um. Tape, like always. What a dumb fucking question was that? What happened with the dog anyway? Uh, you attach the battery to the mecha dog, some sort of light start blinking, so that's a good sign. Just stop staring at it so intently, Captain. It's probably happen overnight. Robot probably need a few days to charge up fully. Okay, so everything's, everything's pretty Gucci for now. Ah, <sighs> uh, nice. We got some soup. Starving, hungry, starving. <laughs> so you need food first and foremost. You need soup as well. You need to craft some more soup. And this. Uh, I've been scrubbing something in small notebook of hers. You ask her about about it, she beat you to a punch. Megan said very soon, I'd like to draw you. Would you be my model? Probably like one of your French girls. I'm going Chinese. Yeah, why not? Probably great with anorexia going on right now. Yeah, it's probably like one of your French girls. <laughs> I bid you to a bitch! Uh, you said with April with unparalleled light enthusiasm. She started measuring your body with her thumb. She proceeded to sketch her tongue with sticking out in a very artsy fashion. Um, okay. Okay, so there was... Um, I had a cramp. Then you look through a hygiene and brush teeth in a while, so I need to pull an ass tooth before it gets worse. Um, it'll be okay. 
I am pretty boss. Get mm. hungry. Bam! We're doing good. We're doing really good. Shut up. Okay, he brought back some of that. A book. Nice, I needed that. And soup. Um, it appears some kind of droid. Just activate a web stack on the back. Carries uh, fill some metal scrap, visit plant, other oddities, including something which looks like a skull. Um, yes. Fuck that robot. I'm gonna go back to the village. April, you'll go to the village. Perfect. Bam! Right there. Wow, I've been recording for about 50 minutes. I didn't realize it. Uh, the creepy droid outside banged on the hole for a bit. The binoculars lens flaring and leaned back on the touch of a horse. Then the tiny crooked arms began pushing against the door with incredible force. Um, flew off, but not before you were all left famished. Um, okay. So everybody's hungry now. But those two are starving. Ah. Uh. Ah. Mm hmm? Who is Captain? My calculations are correct. Robot Dog activates itself very soon. Don't get too excited. It's not going to happen today. Turning part should be complete in the coming days. Want to introduce any finishing touches? Now's probably the time. Robot Dog is looking a little bland, to be honest. I do believe uh, that any robot is fine without the bells and whistles, but perhaps I'm a little too rational, old-fashioned. You can introduce some upgrades if you feel if you really feel strongly about it. Please don't add glitter. Only Rogue Automaton units use it. I don't like glitter. It's coarse and rough and irritating. It gets everywhere. Sure. Before I end this day, I'm going to go ahead and pause it and come back to it in a little bit. I do have to end the episode here, take a break, and I'll be back recording. I'm out of soda, and I've been recording for almost 55 minutes, but I didn't even realize. So, as always, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, have any suggestions, give me tips, comments, put in the comment section below, and I will see you all in the next episode.